My name is Matt Spragna. I'm the Director of Operations here at FIBA Technologies in Littleton, Massachusetts. Our monthly production target goals is 240 vessels per month, and we're able to achieve that goal now with our new machine. The new Solar Ruthe FLP 1400 is capable of running six tubes per eight hour shift. So we have about a 50% increase in productivity. FIBA's products are used in many different industries, including electronics manufacturing, oil and gas exploration, space exploration, alternative fuels. The hydrogen fueling market's really taking off right now. We're providing a lot of product to that industry. We make tubes anywhere from seven feet long all the way up to 42 feet long. So our pressure vessels have no welds anywhere on them. It's called a seamless pressure vessel. Without the weld, it can withstand much higher pressures. The spinner basically heats the end of the pipe up real hot and makes about 30 passes with a wheel, similar to a pottery wheel, to close the end of the tube. Once the metallurgy lab determines that the steel is okay, tubes then go on to our new Solar Ruse CNC machine. The machine will move around the tubes rather than the tubes having to be spun around manually by the operator. So the operator can just load three vessels into the machine and machine all three tubes start to finish without needing the crane. There are about 12 steps that the new machine is doing on each vessel. The first step will be a saw cut, cut off the end of the neck. The next would be an OD roughing tool. Next, an ID roughing tool will rough the inside of the tube. Then we follow it up with more probing just to make sure our dimensions are exactly correct. No manual measurements are made by the operator. Everything is done by the machine. Then they will come back. Sometimes we need to use a chamfer tool, and then the ID threads will be put on, and most of the tubes that we make will have OD threads as well. The new universal head on the new Solar Ruth machine is capable of articulating and drilling a hole at 45 degrees in the dome of our vessel, which we were unable to do on our old machines. This used to be a very time consuming, laborious process for us. FIBA Technologies was started in 1958. It's currently a third generation family run business. We are a leader in the global gas containment and transportation industry. FIBA has about 300 employees right now. We have seven locations, six are here in the US. This is our global manufacturing headquarters here in Littleton. We have about 150 employees here. So Morris has provided great service to us since we've installed the machine. They helped us get the machine installed initially, and the after-sales support has been excellent. They're a local company. If we need something, they can remote into the machine from their office and have us back up and running in the same day. If a technician does need to be on site, they can usually be here next day. We've been extremely happy with the new Solar Ruthe machine. It's lived up to our expectations, and we see them being a partner for FIBA for a long time into the future.